Yeah, whatever people view us and subscribe us, you're welcome back again. Nigerians. <laughs> it has been on the social media the question from nooks and cranny. People are wondering why is it that this hardship hitting Nigeria back and forth like a table tennis is not being complained by the people of the East. <laughs> have eventually turned their lives around properly it is their turn to have the lion's share of this government the impunity gushing out from this government they have the lion's share and nobody should take it away from them you want me to leak the secret let me tell you if you come to the east they are still doing dorime oh yes they are still doing dorime if i had wanted i would have been in one one fiesta they are conducting everywhere, every weekend, the celebration in Igbo land. If you want to hang yourself, go and hang yourself. Because these people are made different. They are forged differently. Go and ask questions. Hey, people, after the genocidal war, you took everything from them. You destroyed everything about them. You gave them only 20 pounds. And you thought that they would never rise. Today, they are the deciders and drivers of this economy, whether you like it or not. And you think they are ordinary people. <laughs> you think it's about electricity, that you can stop them. The problem with Nigeria is that they forget so easily. When you are fighting against a people that is made differently, you are just about killing yourself. The only person that, let me tell you, from the history of this country, if you check it, it is only Ndibu that believes in this thing you called One Nigeria. And they are practicable about it. They are the only ones that can fix this country for your own good. And even when they say, okay, since you don't want us in, let us be on our own. You say, why? And you think you are doing them. You are doing yourself. And let me tell you, that even if one dollar hits three thousand, an Igbo man go the work. You know why? No matter the hardship in the jungle, the lion can never shop grass. He can never go hungry. So get it into your skull. You people are crying everywhere. They are crying. Why is it from the north and the west? You people, you are not. You not seen anything. You think it's about religion? Muslim, Muslim ticket. You think it's about ethnicity and Milokon? Now you are you are feeling the heat. And let me. Don't get it twisted. There are Yoruba people and the Hausa people, obedient Nigerians, that saw beyond ethnicity and religion. And they pen down their solidarity with the obedient Nigeria who wants to free Nigerians from the impunity we are facing today, the calamity we are going through today. There are some, some of them. But many of you refuse to heed. 
just like this one. See, Yawo, see, Yawo. Toma, Toma, Tinubu. Oh, she! Emi mo ko ma she. Tinubu, Emi mo ko ma she. Modupe, Modupe, Modupe. Oh no, Modupe, Modupe. To fun mi ni baba gidi. O goro ma ko gba. So ma dite. Se Tinubu. To ba dite re mi. E ni shori re. Bo bo jati mo ti fi bu family yiri. O goro ma pa mi ro. Ogun o ni pa mi. Ogun o ni pa yin na. Mi ku bu yin ri Olorun inu mi. O se ko ni da fe to ba di te o. O ma se mi o. In fact, o ma se 50 years. Oh, then ni ku and soon the other one. Lo wo la mo to mo o. O ma bere si ni pa yan kiri ni Nigeria ni o. E ro pe ko si peace wa le ko. O ma lo sinu government house lo ma pa awon eyan. Because e wo nkan te n se you are putting stress on Nigeria. Talk here, your conny. If it wants in town, Jay, OTD, 4,000 naira. Nissin, Tipo, got in rice. Talk him at the 5,000. Talk it to your carani, one pack for 4,000 naira. And your con so short, you are the 4,000. Sherry Ben got in one, bearable. Cement 9,000. Cement, you wear it, you wear it, don't go to here. OTD, 9,000. And the lossy neighboring country, Africa. One thousand one thousand five hundred in bed, and then Jackie Bobo Kony Olara Yoruba no one already thrown oh Yoruba ten fifty C go coin me oh me oh bow oh eh ni sorry re oh eh ni sorry re oh be ba change ko eh ko suffer me taleni ibola fifty to right here simple and lastly ma increase cost of living is it that affect by everybody affect by everybody ni. And so for me, even the billionaires, to the normal billionaires, to the entity, one nearly in Koshima, because poor people don't feed the Oh, well, poor people left in the billionaire. Poor people, you know, one nearly in Koshima. You see, just like it. Many will complain. They are flogging you to give you bread. You are collecting bread. With the cane, you are shopping the pain to shop bread. <laughs> it is just the starting point. We have not gotten to the destination yet. By the time this government finishes it four years, perhaps if you get sense, it will stop at four. But if your sense continues, the mumu mentality you have today, it will reach eight years. And by that time, <laughs> Only God knows what fragment of Nigeria will be left standing. Let me just keep it at this. I just want to remind you. Okay? Because we refuse to learn from history. You cannot stop a people like Ndebo. I'm not saying this because I'm an Igbo man, but I'm trying to tell you the hard truth. Go and check. No matter how bad this country is, it will never affect people from the southeast that badly. Rather, they will turn it around and take advantage of it. Now you go suffer. I want to say it to my people: Do not join any hardship protest. Let them protest their emilocal themselves. Let them celebrate it in protest. We, not a free, we go be. Help me share this video. Let me talk. Call me ethnic because that is your business. Because it don't read. Bye bye for now.